Hey guys and welcome to a brand new series here on the channel. So if it's your first time here, welcome. And if you have been here on the channel before, welcome back. We are starting today with the brand new release, New World, which has just come out today. And we're going to get started playing straight away. So I just watched through the intro video, which is about five minutes long. So I didn't include the whole thing on. And we're going to get started with the game. So let's go through the character selection. And we're going to make it look like me. I know a lot of people like to make them look as stupid as possible. But I like so they can look, well, at least similar to me. How do we make it? So I'm not going to spend 15 minutes of the video doing this. So let's jump through. Let's just skip through this really fast. So there we go. That's much better. Let's get username. In. I can't put another skull, which is a bit annoying. There we go. So that is all done. I do like the face tattoos on this. Um, I gave the option to have like scars and stuff like that, but I like this one. It reminded me, as soon as I saw it, it reminded me of the House of Night books. Okay. Cutscene. And let's get started, or is there going to be more cutscenes? Okay, so there's probably going to be a bit of a tutorial now, so I'm going to go through the tutorial like really quick so I'm not boring you guys with it. time to do some combat so it's got the little things at the side so it's pretty easy light attack heavy attack there's just left and right mouse button and then left shift for dodge which i will forget every single time because these kind of things i usually just end up spam clicking the left click button so i will end up dying quite a lot drowned soldiers drowned sailors not soldiers if i could actually read um what am i supposed to be doing escape the ship graveyard and look for your crewmates i wonder if there's anything hid around these or it's just like the beginning so it's just directly you know just run through the middle don't bother look at anything yeah i think it is just run through the middle and kill sailors along the way are these, are these my crew or something are these supposed to be like the people that are on my ship if so that's a bit mean oh weapon mastery sword and shield level two do we have to level all these things up separately or can i just pick which ones i like hmm i would like magic choose an ability one unspent mastery point let's just choose that commit oh that gives me an ability oh god no it's going to give me more buttons so i'm going to have to be like keep looking at the keyboard if this ends up with like 20 different keys i'm gonna be useless at this what button is that on my keyboard i have no idea what button that is on my keyboard they didn't think about this because that button could be different depending on what country you're in and i don't know where that is on a danish keyboard oh look how pretty the map is i thought it was gonna be dark and gloomy and horrible Oh, that's a nice intro. I need to get rid of the the text off the top. That's really quite annoying. So I'm guessing that is like the tutorial and now we're on to the actual main part of the game. That would make sense. Soul Survivor. I'm guessing that. So that's the tasks up there. Descend into the grotto to investigate the smoke. I'm guessing that's this big pile of smoke coming from the middle of nowhere. So let's just, yeah, you know, I've got no shoes on. I'm in tattered clothes. I've got a crappy sword and shield. Let's just jump into a big pile of smoke and lightning and red glowy things with a crazy dude that looks really, really creepy. That's really the smart thing to do. Have I got to kill this dude now? Because, yeah, uh, at least he's level one. Ca oh, he's my captain. Great. So so we'll just, you know, crash, 
kill all our crew and, and kill the captain who looks a bit crazy. That That's very smart. You would have been better off dying at sea. Thank you very much. Respawn point activated. Oh, we've got chat now. Game chat. Also, I guess I can see everywhere in the world. That says global, which is nice. I'm probably not going to use the chat for a while while I'm focusing on learning the game. Investigate the watchtower. I really guess that's the big glowy yellow beam. Let's go have a see what's over here. Talk to Tahir Fayette. Well, you don't look like one of the drowned. There's life in you yet. I like that they do and talk. The problem is they talk so slow, it's just quicker to read it and, and not nice listen to them chatting. Complete the quest. Your situation may seem. Almost every oh, that was just arrive here. Julius boots. Oh, we'll get some boots. They could have been pretty shoes. At least I'm not walking around barefoot. Yeah, what happened to the crew? Do we need to go through this? Let's just skip through. Accept quest. Go challenge accepted. I need to stay here Investigate the shipwreck. Let's put my shoes on first. Now I'm not walking around barefoot. Investigate the shipwreck. Mark on your map. Defeat three drowned. They're the drowned shoulders. Oh, flint. So let's pick these up because they're probably going to need it. Is it this shipwreck? Where's my map? There's a ship back over there. Let's go have it. Let's go have a bit of an explore. Oh wait, went all glowy when I got over here, and, and I'm getting attacked by a drowned something. I didn't read it. Something beginning with M. What's it say? Drown Marina. Marina. However you pronounce it. Oh, that's taking it off. Okay, so that's this. That is the ship I needed to go to. See, I can do this without looking at map. Let's just go kill some more of these dudes. Get some XP. Even though I'm done, I need to go back to speak to the Watchtower dude. Oh, there's dead sailors everywhere. How many people are on that ship? Oh, he's coming up behind me. Kill him. Don't. I'm, I can't die this early on. Let's go back and speak to Watchtower guy. Watchtower dude, what's up? Complete the quest. Give me some pants. Duelist's pants. They can take these tattered things off that I've got. Are we going to give me something else to do level 3? Level 3 already. Gather stuff. Let's put my pants on first. What's that? Fishing bait. Tattered pants. Yeah, let's just leave them there for now. Fishing I have no idea about. And stuff. I picked that flint up before. Uh, gather green wood from a nearby bush. What's this? Okay, that's that's my missions. Points available. Oh, this is like leveling up, so I can choose what. So that one is Warhammer, Great Axe Sword, and Hatchet. Bow, Rapier, Spear, and Musket. Intelligence, fire staff, and ice gauntlet. That's what I want. I want to do magic. How do I do magic? I guess that comes later. Constitution, yeah, that's health, isn't it? You know, same as everything. Primary attribute for the life staff. I don't know what a life staff is. So right now, I think we need strength and constitution. I think we need some more HP and we need to be able to attack a little bit better. So we'll just split them out between the two. Maybe I'll die a little bit less often. Let me know in the comments when you think I'm going to die for the first time. I give myself 10 minutes. Let's pick up some stuff. I need to go gather green wood from a nearby bush. Now where is a bush? I can see lots of bits of grass. Where is a bush? Is that a bush? No. Is that a bush? Where's the bushes? Oh, it's a pig. It's, a, it's not a pig, it's a boar, but yeah. Is that... Where, where's the bushes? 
Do we chop them down? Can I, can I, can I get wood from this? No. Give me some wood! Um, maybe we need to go the other way. Let's try up here. There's trees, so I'm guessing trees will give me wood. Do we cut them down? How do we get... Oh, oh it's little circles, wait. Oh, bushes! E. I did it! Green wood. Let's just get some more. More than we need. Because I'm probably going to need more than this later. I got wood louse bait. So it's another game where I have to stand fishing for 10 hours a day. Craft. Ooh. Skinning knife, that's the one. Flint skinning knife. Continue. Yeah, exit. And then... Well done. Complete the quest. Been at sale for some time. Take down one of the balls. Oh, I've got to kind of be a vegetarian. <laughs> vegetarian. <laughs> Me be a vegetarian. What do we do with this now? Uh, equip. Oh, it's got all my tools down there, so I don't need to like switch between. Like you don't have to have a hot bar, and you have to switch between tools. That's nice. Let's go and 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 stab a boar to death. Come here, little piggy. Yes, I know it's not a pig. Ooh, spinny attack. Showing off. Skin the ball to collect pork. E. Okay, so I'm guessing E is just all the gathering stuff. Picking stuff up, interacting with things. You're not very fast, are you? Come on. Get going. Cook a light ration from the recovery food category at Watchtower Dude's campfire. Let's see, light ration, craft. Ooh, level one cooking. Go me. Okay, so I've been wandering around shipwrecks for about 10, 15 minutes. And I just noticed this green one. Oh, that changed the task. So this must be where I need to go. What's this? Undiscovered page. I'm guessing the journal pages I have to collect for an achievement or something. But I noticed a green ship over here after wandering around killing things for a few minutes. Uh, so I'm guessing this is where I need to go. Collect the ship's manifest. Oh, that was that page I just picked up, I guess. Ship's roster and ship's log. That's another page. Oh, that's the ship's log. Supply stockpile. And something that wants to attack me. Ow. Go away. I'm trying to get stuff out of the chest. Thank you very much. Let's try again. What did that give me? Plate helm, plate gauntlets, leather coat, cross weave. Ooh. That's my light rations when I need to eat that recovers 40 health per second for 20 seconds blah 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 so i don't need to eat that just yet so we'll just save that if my health gets too low then i can just eat that when i feel like it uh, kill some more sailor dudes i must have killed everyone on my ship by now so i don't know where the rest of these sailors are coming from so now i need to find the ship roster Oh, I did it. I found it. There it is. Search ship rolls for records and remnants. What? I've just done that. Why do you want me to do it again? Do I have to go to a different ship now? I'm going to die soon. How? So, so whose ship do we need to go to now? So, silly me. Now, finally noticed on that little compass at the top, it's got a number one. That shows me which direction I need to go for the quest and how far away it is. Ooh, level five. Uh, I think we need a bit more health. And I've still got one more, so a bit more strength. Yes, and there was something else that just popped up, but I didn't see where it was. Map. No, I have no idea. Never mind. 
Someone else is here starting as well, who's about the same point as me. I'm guessing the big glowy chest is where I need to go. Yeah, that's the ship's locker. Now what? Oh, now it's moved direction. So now we've got to go to another ship. Am I supposed to be just searching my own ship? Not everyone else's has crashed here as well. I suspect the corruption may be lingering. Okay, so now we explored all the ships and got everything. Now we've done his job for him certain ships. He now wants me to go search a cave as well. While 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 Watchtower dude just just stands there and watches me do him. I guess that's the point of the Watchtower, but that's not the point. Seriously. Dude, you could come and help me. Ooh, shipwrecks. So all the shipwrecks are visited. You can see on the map. What's that one? Company. I don't know what that is. Okay, so let's get go. Let's go find this cave. This is one creepy ass cave. I've been wandering through it, killing some corrupted things. But it's like one minute you're outside and there's trees and there's grass and it's all pretty, and the next minute it's like red dark creepy corrupted like look look at that thing he's got no legs he's just crawling around attacking things and i need to find a chaplain apparently a corrupted chaplain so not only did he have to kill my crewmates oh there's the chaplain not only do he have to kill my crewmates and my captain now i have to kill a, a chaplain that's, that's just great at least only level five although i'm only level five and there's a oh god there's one of those half head body no legs dudes here as well. Don't kill me. Oh, I'm gonna die. Run away. Don't kill me, please. Oh, I, I need to. Can you not eat at the same time? Oh, I think it said something about if you if you get damaged by the heal effects on it doesn't it stops the heal effects. You dead anyway. Oh, go away. Oh, no, two of them. Leave me alone! Look, I killed the chaplain. I don't want to die to you guys. Yes! See, I'm getting strong. I'm awesome. Now, how do we get back out of here? Okay, so the chaplain is dead. I've been gathering some resources. Um, that, not that I really need anything right now, but I'm guessing I'm going to need it, especially if I've got to go somewhere, which I'm guessing I'm not going to stay in this area. Usually this kind of thing, you start in an area, then they send you walking for an hour. So I'll make some more rations. My task at the minute is to open the map, which, yeah, I don't really need to do that right now. Although I might as well. But I thought I'll go make some resources. It's campfire Why I'm here. There's a couple of boars up and around, so I'm collecting a bit of pork. Um, and some bushes, some wood and stuff like that. So we'll make some rations and then we'll have a look and continue on with our quest. We might as well open the map now. So that's the watchtower. What's that? I don't know what that is. Let's go make some light rations. Energizing light ration. What's the difference? That's mana. Mana and... Yeah, I'm guessing that's when I'm doing magic, which I'm not, because I don't know how. Four light rations. Let's just make three, because I don't know if I need pork for anything else. Three. If I can't get to the next section without three, then we'll make one of them just so I've got one, in case I do figure out how to do magic. Wood longsword. I think that's what I've already got. Is it? What else can I build? Nothing. Okay, let's have a look. Watchtower's report. Talk to Miklos Doughty. 450 meters. See, I told you I was going to have me wandering. Look, a boulder. That's a nice boulder. So I got like 100 meters away and, and ran into some random dude with a diamond shaped thing above his head who then gave me a task to go and collect truffles. So now, as you can see, I've got two tasks up there. Gather herbs or berries and gather delicious truffles around the marked area. And I don't know what the marked area is, but there's some glowy things here, which I'm guessing are truffles. Oh, it is the truffles. I already gathered one. Herbs. Oh, optional. Herbs. I might as well gather some herbs as well. Since they gave me the option and they're right here. 
and stinky things on the floor. What was that? Oh, that's where I gathered the first truffle. Oh, they just glow. They show you exactly where it is. Is this like the whole time or does it just because it's the beginning of the game? So I collected the truffles and the dude who wanted the truffles is now gone. And you can see that the little green thing. Oh, don't ram me up the arse. Anyway, you can see the little green thing on the map, which is like, I'm guessing the green one is when you've completed a quest. And they're both near each other, so I'm guessing I can complete both of them about the same time. So we'll head that way now. We found a village. We found that dude who wanted the truffles. And now we found this Miklos. Captain. He looks like a pirate. Windsward Constable. So the pirate is the, like... Police officer, sheriff, whatever. Luckily it's across uh, the yes. But it yes, that is me. Whoa, See, I'm famous. Okay, so, so we'll meet yourself at home, take this message to Magistrate Carab Party, and then knock one back in the tavern. Friend. You've earned it. Okay. So I've been grinding this for a couple of hours now. I've not died. Surprise, surprise. Almost. Not quite. But that's not going to last. I know it won't. Um, so I've just been gathering stuff. I found a lot of things. I didn't have the level for gathering. So I just like kind of ran around to all the herbs and stuff and got to level 30. So I can gather some of the magic things. The moats. The fire moats and stuff like that. Then I can start... Um, Figuring out how to make uh, like a fire staff or whatever it is I need. Um, so we've got level 30 on that. I've not really focused on anything else too much just yet. Uh, and there, there is some other things at higher levels, but I don't need them just yet. So still grinding away. I've been doing a couple of these town projects, trying to get XP and the coin and standing, all that stuff that you need to get up. Uh, not really been following the main quests much just yet. At the minute I need, I can't remember which one it is the main, I think it's the, I think it's number one the main quest at the minute, I'm not quite sure, but I'm not really been following that at the minute. I've been doing, I've been doing some of the town quest things from the notice board as well as some of the faction quests because one of the things I had to do before was join a faction, there's three of them, so I joined the syndicate, I think it's called, yeah. Uh, there's three of them, I joined the syndicate and yeah, I, me, Harry Potter brain just kind of read them and that one sounded the most like Ravenclaw, so I picked that one. Although I was tempted to go with the Marauders, which I think was the green one, just because, yeah, again, Harry Potter brain, Marauders to me, yeah. I couldn't quite decide. But at the minute I'm just going to go through and make some things, try and get some of these levels up. But I might just go do some gathering for a while soon. But this episode is getting a little bit long right now, so I'm hoping you guys enjoyed this. I am having fun playing on here at the minute. It's been difficult over the last month to kind of get the enthusiasm to play because most of the time I'm on either RuneScape or Minecraft and I've been that busy that I've not really had the kind of enthusiasm to go on and play so i haven't really been online that much at all so this is a nice new change and i'm enjoying it so far so it'll be interesting to see what happens with the game i like the fact that there is other people around as well so maybe um, in a few days after learn a little bit of it we'll get into some more social stuff get into the chat have a look at some of the factions or something like that and we'll see what happens but for now I'm going to chill out, keep doing some of these quests, um, these little like town notice board ones. There's not really that much interesting on there, they're just killing things and making things. Get my levels up and then we'll make another episode in a few days. So I hope you guys enjoyed it. Please leave a comment below if you're playing the game, if you are interested in it, if you've got any ideas, tips, anything you want to say, just leave a comment down below and please like the video it really helps so if you want to follow along hit that subscribe button and don't forget the notification bell because yeah that's what youtube likes just us pressing buttons all the time and i will get another episode out as soon as possible so thank you guys for watching and i will see you all next time